The European countries collectively are by far the largest aid providers to Africa. In 2013, European uh, Union institutions, the UK, France, and Germany alone dispersed 28% of all aid to Africa, totaling more than $15 billion. The US was the single largest bilateral source of aid, accounting for 16% of the global total, or $9 billion. The IDA window of the World Bank accounted for 11%, and the Global Fund another 5%. The United Arab Emirates dispersed a surprising 9% of the global total of aid to Africa, $4.8 billion. China provides about $2.5 billion annually. The African Development Bank, $2.3 billion. Japan, just over $2 billion. Canada, about $1.5 billion. Sweden, $1.3 billion. Norway, $1 billion. And the Netherlands and Denmark, just under $1 billion each. Emerging nations other than China and the UAE probably provide well under $1 billion annually. Looking to the future, the Western countries and the development banks will account for the overwhelming majority of aid going to Africa, although the annual dollar amount may not rise above current levels plus inflation. Emerging nations such as China and India will slowly increase their aid, but I don't see any significant rise. Uh, United Arab uh, Emirates aid to Africa in 2013 may have been a one-off event. I doubt it can continue that level of aid in view of the drop in the price of oil. African countries seeking development aid assistance, especially when most of it is in the form of grants, had better continue to look to the West for support over the next 10 years. <clears throat> 